I'm sad. <laughs> he didn't welcome me back to the game. The guy with the questions didn't welcome me back to the game. <laughs> I'm sad. Damn. Rude. Okay. Anyways. Welcome. What's going on, guys? Dumbass Brain here. Welcome back. To the Stanley Parable. Two. This is the story of a man named Stanley. Stanley dot, 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 dot. I've listened to it a million times. Give me more content, please. All of his co-workers were gone. Yeah, we what get it. Mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. No more Bucket. We don't want Bucket this time. We'll take Bucket next time. Okay. I think this episode when Stanley came to a set of two is... This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Ah, yes, truly a room worth admiring. But eager to get this. back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. You know what, we'll listen. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go. Stanley stepped into the broom closet, but there was nothing here, so he turned around and got back on track. Oh, you won't give me, give me anything else? Dang, okay. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Is it just the exact same? Oh, okay. Well, one second. The just Stanley in the bucket. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, but Stanley had felt the bucket calling to him, telling him that the employee lounge was simply the place to be. And here it was. Had the bucket turned out to be correct? No, never mind. The bucket was wrong. Stanley took the door on his left to go back, and so the two of them detoured through the maintenance section and walked straight ahead to the opposite door. I don't think this was the opposite door. The end is never the end. Nah. You're never the end. How about that? Oh, good Stanley. I'm glad you found your way here. I knew you'd find this place eventually. You see, your friends and I are concerned for you, Stanley. We've come together here because we care about you very much. It's this bucket you're carrying around everywhere. The bucket isn't even from the original Stanley Parable. It's just sequel content. We're <laughs> the ones that matter, Stanley. Classic characters from the first game, like the Adventure Line and the Broom Closet. Because that's what fans want from a sequel. They want more of their favorite jokes, not this bucket that they've never seen before. Yes, I know I'm the one who gave you the bucket, but you're spending too much time with it. Don't you want another story involving the Adventure Line? We could make the Adventure Line go somewhere new! Yes, yes! That's what the fans want! Let's do it! Mm, broom closet. Fine, you know what? I'll follow your Adventure Line. For now. Whee! Look at that wacky line! Who knows where it'll go off to next? Oh, and it played some silly music as well. Now this is what the Stanley Parable is all about. Don't you remember all those great jokes from the original dialogue? Also, Stanley is addicted to drugs and hookers. <laughs> yes. It's as classic now as it was back then. Let's do it for the fans, Stanley. Let's give them more content exactly like this. But if we want to do that, you're going to have to give something up. No. No. No, you can't take my bucket away from me. I've done all the endings for it, but still. No. Don't you get it, Stanley? We need to get rid of the bucket. 
That's why I'm very proud to introduce a brand new character. This is the Bucket Destroyer. No. I think it'll make a wonderful new addition to the rich lore of the Stanley Parable. True, it also was not in the original game, but it's such a well-fleshed-out character with so much personality that to me, it already feels as though it's been part of the cast all along. Don't you agree? <clears throat> Can you guess what the Bucket Destroyer does? Surely you don't need me to spell it out for you. Go ahead now, Stanley. Say goodbye to the bucket, and then pop it into the machine when you're ready. Now listen to me. It's crucial that you give it the bucket. I don't know what the bucket destroyer will do if it can't destroy your bucket. Destroying buckets is all it knows. That is its singular personality trait. Sure, I can hear you saying, how does a character with only one personality trait deserve to join the pantheon of beloved Stanley Parable characters? Well, you see, if you were to really explore the Bucket Destroyer, you would see that its desire to crush buckets is so densely loaded with complexity and nuance that it's really like ten personality traits. What other object in this game can you even say that about? The broom closet? Certainly not. I wonder what sort of Bucket Destroyer merchandise the fans will be clamoring for after this. Okay, the Bucket Destroyer is getting very upset now. You'll have to hurry and feed it. We can't get back to the classic Stanley Parable characters like the Adventure Line or the Bucket Destroyer until you crush that damn bucket. Quickly now, the fans are waiting. Do it, the fans, Stanley. Give the fans what they want. Hurry and... I think I need to destroy the bucket. Bucket Destroyer, my prized creation. You had so much potential. We were going to do such marvelous things with you, tell such spell-binding stories about you. All of it squandered now. Goodbye, new friend. For the moment in time that you were here, you were magnificent. What the f I love this game so much because it's just so first off, I don't have to do a lot of commentary. He does a lot of the commentary <coughs> also, but like rah, it's so good i i I'm gonna go destroy the bucket now um I think i I think I have to, and then I'll do this path without the bucket, I think, because like the other path just leads me directly to the ending, so i I, I think I gotta destroy a bucket. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Step Stanley one. Stanley decided to go to the Acquire meeting. Acquire bucket. Where are we going today? The bucket asked. Stanley just smiled. Anywhere <laughs> they went together would be... Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his... This was not the correct way to the meeting room. But Stanley had felt the bucket calling to him. Telling him that the employee lounge was simply the place to be. And here it was. Had the bucket turned out to be correct? No, never mind. The bucket, bucket is wrong. never correct. Stanley took the door on his left to go back, and so the two of them detoured through the maintenance section and walked straight ahead to the opposite door. Rah. Uh -oh. Stanley, I'm Stanley. Don't be concerned. We've come together here because we care about you very much. It's this bucket you're carrying around everywhere. The bucket isn't even from the original Stanley Parable. It's just sequel content. We're the ones that matter, Stanley. Classic characters from the first game, like the Adventure Line and the Broom Closet. Because that's what fans want from a sequel. They want more of their favorite jokes, not this bucket that they've never seen before. Yes, I know I'm the one who gave you the bucket, but you're spending too much time with it. Don't you want another story involving the adventure line? We could make the adventure line go somewhere new. Yes, yes, that's yeah. what the Whee! Look at that wacky line. Who knows where it'll go off to next? Give oh, me the jazzy music. Some silly music as well. Now this is what the Stanley Parable is all about. 
Don't you remember all those great jokes from the original dialogue? Also, Stanley is addicted to drugs and hookers. It's as classic now as it was back then. Let's do it for the fans, Stanley. Let's give them more content exactly like this. But if we want to do that, you're going to have to give something up. Don't you get it, Stanley? We need to get rid of the bucket. That's why I'm very proud to introduce a brand new character. This is the Bucket Destroyer. I think it'll make a wonderful new addition to the rich lore of the Stanley Parable. True, it also was not in the original game, but it's such a well-fleshed-out character with so much personality that to me, it already feels as though it's been part of the cast all along. Don't you agree? Can you, you guess can take what the it. Bucket Destroyer does? Surely you don't need me to spell it out. It destroys you. Stanley. Go ahead now, Stanley. Bye bye. Say goodbye to the bucket, and then pop it into the machine when you're ready. Put it in. Now listen to me. It's crucial that you give it the bucket. I don't know what the bucket destroyer will do if it can't destroy your bucket. Destroying buckets is all it knows. That is its singular personality trait. Sure, I can hear you saying, how does a character with only one personality trait deserve to join the pantheon of beloved Stanley Parable characters? Well, you see, if you were take to my really bucket. explore the bucket destroyer... Fine, don't take my bucket. Screw you, bucket. Why your bucket mother left you. When Stanley came to a set of two open... This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley... You're not the correct way to the meeting room. Well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. it Standing I... now in this incredible room, Stanley for the first... But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Wow. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Okay, so what happens if I don't have bucket? bucket to keep forever because Stanley doesn't want to destroy his stupid bucket. But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. So now in order to get back, he needed to go, um, uh, uh, uh from here it's, um, left. Oh. Oh, Last of Us is installed. I mean, no, it's not. Oh, not no. Playing. No, it's to the right, my mistake. No, 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 not the right. Why would I have ever said it was to the right? What was I thinking? It's clearly... Oh, dear, would you hold on for a minute, please? Now, let's see. We went down right, left, down, left... Right. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yes. I've got it now. This story is absolutely, definitely this way. So it's behind this door. Because, like. Whatever. No. I'm not going that way. You cannot make me. Okay, maybe you can make me. So, like, if I just go this way, does it bring me back to the original? No, 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 no. This isn't right at all. You're not supposed to be here yet. This is all a spoiler. Quick, Stanley, close your eyes. Okay, 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 okay. We just, we just have to get back to, um, oh. Who am I kidding? It's all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. How about, rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, we'll just restart the game from the beginning. And this time, suppose we don't wander so far off track, hmm? Okay, from the top. Huh? How dare you? I don't think it's actually the... If I wandered... It's definitely not, it started me there. Were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Nice. 
So like, if I were to go back there, I wonder what happens if I go straight back. No, Wait a minute. No, I restarted. I swear, I definitely restarted the game over, completely fresh. Everything. Told should you. Be... Oh, did something change, Stanley? Did you change anything when we were back in that room with all the monitors? Did you move the story somewhere, or a... hold on? Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. It was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. Okay then, it's an adventure. Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. No, I want to go this way. Uh, I want to go this way. Is it back here? This is torture, isn't it? Th this is this is what I get for not following your story, huh? I'll say it. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you there definitely was a story here before. Do we just... Do we need to restart the game again? Well, I find it unlikely that we'll ever progress by starting over and over again. But it's got to be better than this. Okay, let's give it a shot. Why not? Uh-oh. That looks normal. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. I don't know. Nope, there's no doors now. Okay, yep, it's worse. I might be remembering this wrong. It's possible the story is back where we just came from. Why don't we go back the other direction and see if we missed anything? Is this gonna like open up new stuff? Uh -huh. What the frig? I knew we'd miss something. The story it's not another one of them. Comes. No, wait, never mind. Not the story. Okay, let's head back the other way and retrace our steps. This is new. Now this... Well, I'll be honest, I don't recognize this place at all. Is this the story? I don't think so. I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place in an office building. It... Is that correct? Hmm... Do you remember, yeah. Stanley? Well, do you know what? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? You win! Congratulations! Hey. Yay! Yeah. hard work, and it really paid off. So, good job. Oh, no. No, I don't feel right about this at all. We both know you didn't put in any actual work for that win. Some people win fair and square, uh, oh, and this I'm was not one of those situations. Okay, I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I don't care what might happen this time, I have to restart. Okay then. I'm glad we went this way without the bucket. All right, I've got a solution. This time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Hey, Just adventure. The line. How simple is that? No, no, I'm down. We're leaving it up to the line from now on. Oh. Okay. Wait, does that mean this gets to open up more? Yay. Fine. I won't go over there. I'm going to actually follow the line until, you know, I can... You see? The line knows where the story is. It's over in this direction. Onward, Stanley, to destiny. Though, here's a thought. Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there? Or, to put it another way, is the story of no destination... Still a story. Simply by the act of moving forward, 
Are we implying a journey such that a destination is inevitably conjured into being via the very manifestation of the nature of life itself? Okay, Stanley, I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. Now, we can both agree that the nature of existence is, in fact, a byproduct of one subjective experience of that existence, right? Okay. okay. Now, if my experience of your existence rests inside of your subjective experience of this office, is this office, in fact, the skeleton of my own relative experiential mental subjective construct? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. That got a bit weird back there. Well, I'd like to apologize. Not sure where I was going with all that. You know what? I think what we need right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. Give me the music. Bum, bum, bum. the music go back and look at that fern Stanley this fern will be very important later in the story make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully you won't want to miss anything okay wait what we're back at the office no 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 line you do know we're looking for the Stanley parable right the story is any of this ringing a bell? Oh, uh, we're going through every door that we've seen, basically. Got it. Oh, no, 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 not again. Line, how could you have done this to us? And after we trusted you, after everything we've been through, you... Oh, I can't take this anymore to hell with it. Restart. But I liked that. Not the line again. You know what, Stanley? I say forget the adventure line. What's it ever done for us? We're intelligent people, right? Why can't we make up our own story? Something exciting, daring, mysterious. Ooh, this all sounds Open door perfectly party. doable. Why don't we simply start wandering in, well, I don't know. How about this direction? This is supposed to be an office. It's 437. Now. Yes, this is exciting. Just me and Stanley forging a new path, a new story. Well, it could be anything. What do you want our story to be? Go on. It's an endless uh, square again. Whatever it might be, Stanley, I'm ready for it. I want not the back rooms. Oh, no, not you again. Stanley, I'd also like to veto the line from having any role in our awesome new story. No lines or monitor rooms. Just don't acknowledge it, and we should be fine. Hmm. Not acknowledging you. Just don't play your loud music. Thank you. Bye-bye. Ah, a choice. We get to make a decision. From here, the story is in our control. How important we mustn't squander the opportunity. In fact, I believe I need a minute to think here. Just walk in circles for a minute. Okay. No. So I know that each door has to lead somewhere, which means that somewhere at the place where we're trying to go, there must be a reverse door that leads here. And that in turn means that our destination corresponds with the counter-inverted reverse door's origin. So starting from the right, let us ask, will taking the right door lead us to where we're going? And since the answer is clearly yes, then by all accounts, the door on the right is the correct one. Another victory for logic. Come, Stanley. Our destiny awaits. I don't get a choice. Oh. oh hold up, what's this? Hmm. Hmm. The confusion ending. You're telling me that's what this is? It's all one giant ending? <laughs> 
And we're supposed to restart the game eight, eight times? That's really how all this goes? It's all determined? So now, according to the schedule, I restart again. Then what? Am I just supposed to forget? Well, what if I don't want to forget? My mind goes blank simply because it's written here on this, this thing, wall. Well, who consulted me? Why don't I get to decide? Why don't I get a say in all of this? Is it really? No, it can't be. I, d I don't want it to be. I, I don't want the game to keep restarting. I, I don't want to forget what's going on. I don't want to be trapped like this. I won't restart the game. I won't do it. I won't do it. I won't do it. Yes, the word. timer to stopped? Does that mean, um, did we do it? Did we break the cycle? The, um, whatever it is that made this schedule? How would we even know? Will someone come for us? Will something happen? So, okay. I guess now we just wait, you know. I suppose in some way that this is a kind of story, wouldn't you agree? I'm not quite sure if we're in the destination or the journey. Though they're always saying that life is about the journey and not the destination. So I hope that's where we are right now. We'll find out, won't we? Eventually. Well, in the meantime, if you... I didn't like that noise. I did not like that noise at all. It's darker. Already this was uncomfortable, and Stanley decided that as soon as he found a new space he felt safe in, that he would never leave it again. A good bucket, a strong bucket, a humble bucket, a committed bucket, a bucket of culture and distinction. Going back to my office. Can't go back to my office. Give him my bucket. I'm keeping my bucket. Do you have my two doors? Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his chest and entered the door on his left. Okay. Is the line back somewhere or something? Because that's the Still door no end. Here. Stanley needed the bucket's warmth and comfort now more than ever. Perhaps his boss's office was where he'd find Aunt Stanley, we must move on from this broom closet simply because I have no remaining stickers. If I did, you... Okay. Well, I think that's going to be it for this episode, guys. If you did enjoy, like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification button if you do that since the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Um, although, we do have one more time, and it's the epilogue. Can't wait. Goodbye.